Hi, I'm Larry Herb, Xbox Live's Major Nelson. Welcome to this week's Developer Diary. This week, we're going to talk about avatars in the new Xbox experience. And with me is Stacy Law, who's the program manager for Avatar. Stacy, hello. Hi. So what can we expect with avatars in the new Xbox experience? So first of all, avatars are a 3D representation of yourself that you could use in your dashboard, that you could use in a multiple different applications, mm-hmm. including you know, photo sharing app. You can see them on your friends list. You can see them in games. And that's actually one of the most exciting parts that we have. In addition, I can also take my avatar and I can dress him or her up, right? Right. One of the first things that you'll be able to do when you turn on the new Xbox experience this fall is that you'll be asked to create an avatar. And when you create the avatar, you could customize the facial features, but at the same time, you can dress them up in clothes that you want to wear. You could put earrings on them. You could choose the shoes that you put on them. You could choose you know, different jackets and just customize them however you'd like. Avatars can also be used in Xbox 360 games, and Scott Brody's going to tell us about that. So, Scott, these are free updates that are going to be available for Xbox Live Arcade titles and retail titles over Xbox Live, correct? Yes, yeah, we have an, uh, a set of five titles coming out for Xbox Live Arcade that, um, that will be featuring avatars. We've got Uno, which will have custom animations, and we'll be putting them in place of your gamer tag. We'll also have Bomberman Live. Bomberman Live will actually be putting your avatars uh, right next to Bomberman, and you'll be able to see them throughout the game and in all the situations where you, you would see Bomberman in the menus. There's actually a really nice spot where you can uh, gloat with your avatar in the victory screen. We also have Hardwood Hearts, Hardwood Spades, and Small Arms coming up, as well as Seen It from Microsoft Game Studios. What has been the reception by the publishers and the avatars? They must be excited to be able to use them. They've been really excited, um, both with Avatars and Live Party. Um, we've been really excited to, uh, to see that uh, a lot of publishers are really looking to integrate Avatars into their titles. You say they're going to integrate them in the titles, but what does that mean? I mean, are they going to be able to dance around? You talked about one putting up the number one finger. What are some of the other cool things we can expect? Well, I think that's, uh, that's up in the air right now, and what's great is that uh, a lot of our developers are applying their creativity to, to what Avatars can do. But we do have a couple titles coming up that'll, um, that will be taking a uh, much greater advantage of uh, Avatar features. And one in particular I want to uh, tell you about, but we're going to have to hold off on that, but I'm really excited about what it's putting in the game. Thanks, Scott. That's a look at Avatars and the new Xbox experience, which will be available worldwide on November 19th. I'm Larry here of Xbox Live's Major Nelson. We'll see you next time.